The following program is rated PG-13. I don't know if your kids should watch or not. It depends on your kid, but be watching them. Well, Jennifer, um, here on Crafts and Cocktails, we yes. don't just drink cocktails. Mm -hmm. We also make crafts. Yes. I actually, I don't, wait a minute, hold on. Hold Very on one second. Stay right there. Stay right there. What are we making? What are we making? Oh, right. This, what is this called? Decorative notebook. Welcome to my she shed and welcome back to crafts and cocktails. Crafts and cocktails. My guest today has been my friend for quite a few years. She is a mother like myself. However, she looks like she's barely birthed a fart. She has been a working actress since she was but a wee child. You can see her on all the BET movies. The movie, My Wife Took My Husband. But then you're like, but isn't that her husband? And then you talk about, then it's like my aunt, she's dead, but she's alive. Then Tyler Perry's Meet My New Best Friend. All the BET movies she's been on, but you also saw her growing up on my wife and kids, please put your hands together for my very good friend, Miss Jennifer Freeman. <laughs> yeah, I love that introduction. You know, I mean, Jennifer stay working. Jennifer hustles. They be like, we got a black movie. She's like, I'm black. I can do that movie. I haven't seen Jennifer all pandemic. Yes, this, this is, is our true. first time yeah. we've seen each other. Yeah. Oh, we've got. I have a child the same age as her child. Yes, I have a twelve-year-old daughter, Isabella. Isabella, I love. That's my. That's my son's friend. I don't like. I don't like when people try to marry off my child. I, I mean, like he <laughs> is a boy, but if he was gonna marry somebody right now, I'd be like, well, we gotta find Isabella <laughs> because I like her mama and I like Isabella. That's what we are gonna do right now. It's Jennifer, how you been? I've been good. Jennifer brought half of a shirt. She got attacked <laughs> by a wildcat <laughs> on the way here. You know, I was just trying to look very cute for you. You never no. not oh, look cute. No. I mean, just you look adorable. But she got attacked and she still looks sexy. <laughs> so this cocktail that I made today, if you wouldn't mind picking it up. All right. Is what I like to call forever young. I love it. Yes. Okay. We'll drink a little bit and I'll tell you how I made it. Okay. It turned out okay. I wasn't sure what this was going to taste like. Oh, this is really nice. I know. It almost tastes like you're drinking a diet. Yeah. Yes. Oh, a diet? A diet, yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, oh, this is a diet I I'm drinking. I love this because I don't really actually like sweet, like sweet, sweet drinks. Yeah, and so it's, it's not like very sweet. Perfect. It's like refreshing. That's what, exactly what it is. Yes. That's what a diet is. It's refreshing. Let's refresh this <laughs> fat and get it up out of here. Let me tell you how I made Forever Young. First, you need a instrument that you can put liquid in like a shaker yeah <laughs> that's what you need you need an instrument that you can put stuff in but put it to the side because then you're gonna chop up some mint very precisely nicely 10 specific pieces of mint chop it up put it inside the shaker what I say it you're gonna pour a little bit of lime juice just a little bit you want to give it a citrus splash you're on the beach on a diet then you're gonna add just a splash of sugar because as you can see, Jennifer does not wear full clothing, so we don't wanna mess up her day. Just a splash. Then you're going to gently muddle, just very slightly. You just wanna express the flavors of the mint and of the sugar, so you just wanna gently. Next, you're gonna add some ice because we ain't drinking hot drinks here. We're the hot girls, okay? <laughs> Throw a couple of cubes in there. Then you're gonna add about three ounces of rum. Splish splash, it was taking a bath. Then you're gonna shake it up. Put that top on. Shake it, shake it, shake it like a salt shaker. Pop, 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 pop. Brrr. After you pour it in the glass, then you're gonna add some ice and then you wanna top it off with sparkling water. But because we're bougie here at Forever Young Crafts and Cocktails, we're gonna do lavender water. Uh, if you don't have a bottle opener, use your might. As a black woman, if you're watching this, your ancestors are in your hands. Open it. And if they're not, <laughs> if they're not, use a bottle opener, open that thing. Top it off, garnish it with some mint, and voila, you too can stay forever young. Yes? Mm, like cheers. me and Jen. Cheers. Yes. Mm, 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 mm. Well, Jennifer, here on Crafts and Cocktails, we don't just make cocktails, girl. Mm. We also make crafts. Yes. So on today's Crafts and Cocktails, to be able to help you express your journey mm. in life, we are making decorative notebook covers. 
Oh, I love that. Wow. Am I supposed to pose? Jennifer, I'm so glad that you're here. This is great. <laughs> I <don't> know. <laughs> mm. <laughs> yeah, I know. I'm Jennifer. You know what? I don't really actually drink. You don't? No. Well, you are today, I know, girl. I know. This has this got is, real liquor in it. I know. I love it. Good. It's amazing. It's this amazing. Is, this drink is really, really good, actually. Mm. Yeah. I try to make sure I make all of my guests drinks mm -hmm. that they would actually enjoy. Mm -hmm. And I can tell Jennifer's going to enjoy this. Jennifer has been on such a great journey in life, a journey with triumphs, with heartaches, with passion, with pain, all the things. And it ain't everybody's business, okay? But today, we're going to make these journals that can be that we're going to cover. See, look at this. It says, messy, 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 messy. This is someone who can't get their together <laughs> but that's not my friend Jennifer that's not her she's constantly getting her together so um I brought different images for our covers I you know what I think of you as hmm. you're like the phoenix Aww. you always rise right I love that Thank you're you. very welcome it doesn't matter again Jennifer be living life out here okay and she comes on here she does these terrible tiktoks because she ain't got not a bit of rhythm <laughs> But you see that phoenix, you see that phoenix, you see that phoenix trying to rise from the ashes and it'd be like, woo, girl. So I got some really great like motivational images that we can kind of base our designs off of. We got like somebody with the light of the Lord flowing through them. I love this one. She be spiritual. Mm -hmm. Jennifer am, be spiritual. I, I know spiritual. a lot of times people don't think that folks that show their abdomen, especially their high abdomen, are not spiritual. <laughs> Jennifer is spiritual. That's oh, what, yes, I am. My faith is very important to That's me. how Jesus get to her. It's right there in that open <laughs> hole. He just, she said, let me make it easy for the Lord to get to me. Don't be having to fight through all this cotton, God, and all this black world. Get here in the open spot I made for you. Huh? When the Lord, the, his parents can find a vacancy at the end, Jennifer said, I will make a vacancy for you. You will never have to be born in a barn again. You can be born in my sternum. Oh, um, oh so God. we have another one where it's like the Holy Spirit is lifting them up. Wow. Whoa. Uh, yeah, it's a lot. Yeah, 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 a, yeah. That's very intense. That it picture. is intense. It is very intense. Yeah. And then we have another one. It's a little pixelated. Our printer doesn't do that well here. They, <laughs> I don't know if they're on fire, heartburn, it's something. It, fire, definitely. But it's inspiration. It is. So in order to make these hmm. wonderful notebook covers, we obviously have notebooks. We got composition books. We yes. We each have one. We have acrylic paints, little paints. We have different types of glitter, cute Aww. little embellishments, pencils. We have paint brushes. We have palettes that you can add your color to. Little pom-poms, wire cleaners, beaded stuff. We also have our very specific crafting speeder upper dryer, um, not to be confused with a hair dryer. And we have gel pens. So, right. and oh, and also colorful construction okay. paper to be able to helpfully, you know, use the base and cover, right? As well as no craft is a craft unless there's hot glue involved and we have hot glue guns. Yes, I see For that. the both, both of us to be able to use. So Jennifer, do you feel inspired to be able to make your notebook? I absolutely feel inspired by this. Of course. The, Jennifer's obviously going to have a cute encounter with the Lord. Most of us who be in church, we be drooling. That's how we have our meeting with Lord. Jennifer's meeting is like, hi, God. How are you? <laughs> let me tell you. Let me tell you, God. Cheers. OK, let me tell you what's going on in my life. It's been so crazy. <laughs> The Lord be sitting down, he take off his sandals. He be like, let me talk to you for a little bit. <laughs> so are you feeling inspired? I am feeling very inspired by this. Okay, so that's, mm -hmm. you don't have to do a replica, but I wanted you to have inspiration. Oh wait, we're not cutting this? I'm you can, this you can do oh, it. We got scissors on the wall and yeah. So you can do whatever. Oh, yes, there but is. But before we begin, first question for you. Mm -hmm. What does it feel like for you to live your best life? Cheers. Oh. You got drink before you think. Drink, yeah. Oh, that. that I yeah, like drink, that saying. Drink before. Drink before you think. <laughs> that is a saying for life. Go ahead. Mm hmm. Mm. For me to live my best life uh -huh. is to live unapologetically. 
Ooh. Ooh. Tell me, explain you know, more. For, for so long, um, as you know, like I think I worried about what people thought about me or whatever. And so it's just like being more free in my decisions and living my life and, and also not letting um, circumstances or things like get in the way of me, like enjoying other parts of my life. Do you that. feel like as an actress that is, that comes from you being an actress that you care? Do you think if you weren't in the limelight, would you care? Or is that just a part of your personality in general? I definitely think um, growing up in the industry, it you know, it's because you have an awareness of people have a perception of you or, you know, and you don't want, you're living your life in front of people. You're not actually doing a craft. You're I know. just talking to me. I you got to do both at the same time. <laughs> where are the glue sticks? Like, I don't yeah. understand. Well, I was like, maybe we can, oh. Thank you. I, you know what, Jennifer? Ah. I don't care what people think of me, but I, I care know. if and my I, help. And, and I admire that so much. Thank you. She's yes. like, I ain't just be out here looking terrible. Don't you <laughs> no, know people are thinking terrible that, things? Not in that way, but I just love <laughs> that you're, you're fully yourself and you don't, you. you know, you don't care. You live your life. And so I think that's also like inspired me as being your friend to, to you. be more like that. Thank you. Oh, here, you need probably, in order to get that, hold on. There you go. Gotcha. There you go. When did you get in the industry, Jennifer? I started acting when I was nine. Nine years yeah. old. Yeah. So I was actually in a grocery store in Long Beach. My mom was a single, was a single mom, and my mom was a nurse. Like knew nothing about arts and entertainment or anything like that. And this manager came up to my mom and was like, "Oh my God, your daughter would be so great at acting." And she like thought, like, "Yeah, right." You know. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, "Yes, yes, I want to do it. I want to do it." So uh -huh. my mom was like, "As long as you take the initiative, you get good grades, and you." you know, you do it, then that's fine. So that's like, that's, that's how you got that's in how I got into the industry. And Let me tell you, y'all see Jennifer and y'all think she's pretty. She is, she's gorgeous. Her mama, cause st she steps on all these hoes necks. That's what her mama look like. Make her a hundred years old, but she looked th 30. That's Jennifer's mama. <laughs> no, make you. no goddamn sense. So you have found it hard being able to break through from people's judgment as you've grown up in the public eye? I think it was more so me, mm. you know, of not really everyone else, but like, you know, not like wanting to make the wrong decision, wrong choice. Ah, uh -huh. Like I think, you know, when you grow up in the industry, you know, you're not allowed to grow up, you're growing up in front of people. Yeah, you're so, not allowed to make the same type of mistakes that a regular child would make. Yeah, because it's out there literally forever. I think that that also carried into like adulthood um, um, not in a good way. You know, mm, it's, been, it's been a journey. She's a phoenix rising from these mother freaking ashes. What's one thing that you are so glad that did not get get in there, Jennifer? Don't be like, afraid. Like, uh, excuse me. <laughs> what is a uh, what's one thing? <laughs> See, I love it. You don't care. I love yeah, it. Jennifer's like, I would never. <laughs> I would never burp. I haven't burped in 20 <laughs> years. I just have heartburn and I just deal with it. <laughs> What's one thing that you're so glad that did not get caught on social media that you did? I mean, so much stuff. Like now I look at my daughter and like just this new generation of like, you know, Instagram and the stories and just social media. I'm so glad I didn't have that. I like, I'm so glad. There's Jennifer so many was things. wild out here. <laughs> I ain't gonna put her business out here. Jennifer was you know, wild. I do know how I know how to have fun. <laughs> I know how to That's have fun. That's the way to put it. She's I like, know. no, I wasn't bored. Let's <laughs> let's get it straight. No, no, no. Me and the Lord had a good time in hell partying. Cause he said he would never no, leave me no, nor forsake me. I come on, Jesus. Come on. Jesus! That's what that was Jennifer. She was like, well, I'll repent. You will forgive me and we're gonna do it again. <laughs> No, that wasn't what happened. That what happened, Jennifer? No, but I, I just, I do know how to have a good time. And I think, you know, <laughs> like, I just wish it's just so different. <laughs> so she's like, like, now. Everything is caught, whether you like, you know, someone will be over here like this and you know. Yeah, they catch everything. And, and you're sitting at the table, you know, mm -hmm. having dinner or something. That's why I vlog, because I'm like, I'm gonna be the one catching what I did. Look at this, <laughs> look at me, look at me. I forgot to put on drawers, look at me. <laughs> That's what I wanna catch. Okay, Jennifer, another, yeah. another question. What's one thing that you wish you were better at? Cheers, drink before you think. Okay, I wanna hear it. Dancing. Oh, Jennifer's a great dancer. <laughs> I really 
wish, like, <laughs> honestly, I wish I could be a pop star. Oh, like, so sing and dance, or you just don't yeah, care? Because a lot I, of pop stars can't sing, so you just want to be able to dance. I want to, I, I can't dance or sing. I attempted to take singing lessons. Oh, you did. <laughs> I did. Oh, and how much money you waste? <laughs> a lot. <laughs> <laughs> I actually took dance lessons Woo! from several people, and they were like, you can't hear the beat? What is the, the beat? <laughs> what, you know, what beat are you hearing? What? This beat. Wait a minute, you, have you, what's one of the TikToks that you've done? Why is this not working? What's one of the TikToks? Yeah, Kyla's, thank you. Oh, Kyla's come in five beats late. Get, get that. What's one of the uh, TikTok dances that you didn't, oh, here you go, that you didn't try to do? Um, I attempt to do them all, actually. What's one that is in your brain? I don't actually, well, okay, I can't think of one that's actually in my brain right now. Do you know I'm a ride it like a cowgirl? Sure. It's like something like, I'm a ride it. Like a rodeo, hog tie it like a rodeo. Okay, so we're gonna ride it, and then we're gonna do a rodeo, then we're gonna hog tie it, hog tie it, then like a rodeo, like a rodeo. Just we're just gonna do that much. We're gonna do half of the tick tock, we're gonna okay. do the tick of the tock. Okay, okay, five, six, seven, eight. I'm a ride it like a rodeo, hog tie it, hog tie it like a rodeo. Uh, Beyonce, she's coming for you. Yes. You saw it. <laughs> <laughs> I am. I you, am. This, you, you think you got Sasha Fierce? This is Sasha Fantastic. You saw it. <laughs> I like that, actually. You, it should be. Once yes. you get a little bit of the sprinkly powder in her, she's going to be all over it. <laughs> Wait, no. <laughs> she's going to be all over it. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm telling you. Look around you. Oh my gosh. Uh, so oh, you have always crap. wanted to be able to oh. dance? Yeah, no, I, I actually, it was it was like, like along with like acting and all, you know. All you wanted to be the little. triple threat. I wanted to be a triple threat, but it just, it, uh, you know, just, I mean, it didn't work out. They you know like, why what? it didn't work out, Jennifer? What? what? Because God allowed you to be so pretty. He can't give you all the things. That's what it is. I appreciate you. Now, I'm telling the truth. I don't compliment. I'm telling the truth. Aww. God was like, well, God dang it. I can't. This is not fair. He says, so give her a regular ass voice. Because she going to be out here. She If she got all the things, she ain't going to act right. She ain't going to act right. I mean, yeah, I, I absolutely would be singing and dancing probably everywhere that I went if I could like Wait actually minute. do it. Five, six, seven, eight. Come on. Hello. Five, six, seven, eight. Hello, angel. <laughs> yes. It's like that. <laughs> so, so recently, so along like like all of my my daughter doesn't like the morning. I'm a very, I'm very much a morning person. Uh huh. So I you know wake her up for school and she yes. like she yeah. she's so grumpy. So anyway, so uh -huh. I figured out if I sang and dance for her in the morning, uh -huh. you know she would get be, up. She would be more pleasant and uh -huh. she would get up right. So I started doing that, and then recently, <laughs> I got a karaoke like the, oh, the, the microphone, microphone, right? So, yes. So I get to have like my little performances. You know, oh yes. Every, you know, morning when I wake her up. It's oh, really great. and does Bella love it? She hates it. She <laughs> absolutely hates it. She gets so mad. <gasps> She's so, like, why are you so I sing terrible? Britney Spears, a little oh. NSYNC. Oh yeah. You know, I I. You give yeah, all of the stuff. I give all the stuff. We need to, oh, well, Jennifer's already moved on to it, so I'm gonna catch on. We're gonna actually get into the hot glue on your finger hurts. We're gonna get onto okay. the design of the front of it, but as we do, I got another question for you. Okay. Okay, ooh, come on, yellow, ooh. Jennifer. Mm -hmm. Oh yes, we have to have the drink. Yes, okay. what is probably the moment <clears throat> that you can think of that you felt your most authentic self? Hmm. Drink before you think. My most authentic self, when I had my daughter, and I like held her, like, you know, came home from the hospital, and I was like, oh my God, like, you know, just like being a mother, mm -hmm. like, and looking at this little face, you know, She's that got I grew. A cute face. You know, it's like, that really felt like my most authentic self. When I tell you there has not been, I think, one woman who is a mother that has been on the show that has named off a different moment than having their child. Really? There is something about mm -hmm. being, you had a cesarean, correct? I did, I did, an emergency cesarean. Yeah. A, emergency mm -hmm. C-section. There is something about 
having either your guts <laughs> sitting on top of your chest or being in the uh, delivery room and taking a poop on the table as your child <laughs> is coming out that makes you feel like, this is me. This is me. This is me. Mm -hmm. You are raising a singular daughter, so it's a little girl who's totally turning into a grown woman. Oh my gosh. That you probably can see a lot of yourself in. What is it like to see someone who is like you, but also so much of herself? It's crazy, cause like, I, now that she's going through her, like she's 12, so mm -hmm. she's going through her hormonal. Oh my God, puberty for a girl, Jesus. Years. I'm like, oh my God, I acted like this. I like mm. called and apologized to my mom. Did you like, really? Because like, you know, to just wake up and there's just like all this head movement. Like, why you got all the head movement going on? <laughs> like, what is this about? You, what yeah, is this? Like, what is this? What is this? Like, you know, eat your breakfast. I did. Oh, all this. You know, you like, all this, like, you better stop, okay? You, you go, I'm gonna snap your little head. <laughs> yeah. So one reason why me and Jennifer's mom, we met and we bonded, Jennifer is also the sister of twins. So her mother had twin girls. Many oh, moons ago. Yes. Mm. I have twin sisters. And, and her mother, I just want y'all to know, her mother only births gorgeous people. Aww. She only births people that are supposed <laughs> to be on Olympus. Being like, but love is so true. And like little white little sheets for dresses and <laughs> That's so what it looks like. I, well, I mean, her mama, you. I birthed pretty kids too, but her mama said, I'm gonna shut this down today. So oh, is it, do you, you see a lot of your sisters in your daughter as well? Yeah, I mean, I, I was actually, I helped raise my sisters. Mm -hmm. So I was excited to have a daughter because I was like, oh, I, I kind of like, I know how to do this. You What's know? the age difference? Um, between me and my sisters is 10 years. Okay. So I was 10 when they were born. Mm -hmm. um, and if you saw them, there is a two year age difference and Jennifer's two years younger. <laughs> It's they're ridiculous. like, they're taller than me. They're like 5'9", five, 5'10", five, and it's crazy. I mean, I'm only 5'3", well, without my heels, you know. I was about to say, yeah. what? I mean, I look taller, but I'm not. Okay, so uh, we're going to take another drink. Okay, <laughs> as we finish this up, because we don't have a lot of time. But I have another really great question that's not usually on the docket. Because you're an actress, and I love to hear things like this, pick it up. Okay. What is one role that mm. you just, Jennifer Freeman wants to add to her resume? You can mm. either tell me what the role actually is or what the role would be like. Wait, ah, drink before you think. It would be one. two roles. Tell me, tell me, tell okay. me, tell me. I, like, you know I love fitness, right? I love working out. Um, well, we can all see. <laughs> but I, but not for the physical benefit. I mean, I, I just like challenging myself and like doing different workouts and like pushing myself mentally. Um, it really helps me. She's dressed like if Xena Princess Warrior <laughs> was a stripper in Atlanta right now. It's hey. super cute. Oh, thank you. I you like look warrior-ish. I love huh. it. It looks so cute. But go ahead. You like fitness. So I would love to play like a, like something action, right? Where like I a Marvel to, character. Yeah, where I would have to like, I would be able to really, you know, be like an action, you know. Well, you know, that. on Crafts and Cocktails, we need to see what your action fight. Let me see a, what would you... <laughs> What would it look like if you had an action fight? I but then, okay, but then the other one would be a villain because no one would suspect that I could be a villain. Because you do look like a little bunny that would never hurt anybody. <laughs> She'd be like, I'll give you the clue but to exactly, save Exactly, right? That would so be what the would best. You, so show me like some of your fight moves, Jennifer. <sighs> you know, but I had so many drinks. And I was nice, Villains so. drink. I know, uh, but uh, you know. Give me just two little fight moves. <laughs> give me, give me two. Riddle. Fight moves! I don't know why my pelvis is a fight move, but what would... Yeah! Oh, come on, hi! Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm gonna drop it down on you. Drop it down on you. You don't even know. You were about yes. to kick me in the head, but I dropped down two inches, mm -hmm. so you missed it. Mm -hmm. So, Jennifer, we got like two minutes. Okay. Let's wrap this up so that we can really show, each, uh, show the audience what we're doing in our... <laughs> <laughs> and how we've journaled. Mine is... Mine is really funny. Yours is great. Like, oh, I yeah. really love it. I really, really love it. Jennifer, what projects do you have coming out? So I have a movie on BT mm -hmm. called A Royal Surprise. I think I named it. My, you, my wife stole my husband. Yeah. Okay, go ahead. 
<laughs> Is that what happens to the royal surprise? What royal black thing they got going on in America? It, it wasn't. It was in South Africa. Oh, and it's you in, there? Yeah, and I'm there. Are you so, South African? No, I'm I not. I'm an say. American in South Africa. Okay. So you, so you have to watch it and see what happens. I was about to say, because yeah. do you have a South African accent? No, 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 no. Definitely. <laughs> I do not do any um, accent well, actually. Do a Southern accent. How you doing down there? She owned slaves. Hey. And they ran away. Angel. And then they ran away I, quickly. I, they I just said, the Angel. And they said, get <laughs> out of here. <laughs> okay, wait, wait. One What's, audition, they asked me to do an accent, right? A southern <laughs> accent. That's what I did. That's what you did? How like, you right doing? Away, I was like, yeah. So it's. This is when you say to them, do you see how pretty I am? Stop it. <laughs> so Stop it. I've Stop it. You, well, this is what you're hiring. A good actress who looks like this. Don't ask me to do no other shit <laughs> because y'all can't afford me. Okay, Jennifer, I want to give you a little more time okay. because Jennifer, let me tell you, on a non-professional level, our career as actresses is extremely difficult. It takes a lot of grit. It takes a lot of tough skin to be able to push through. You know, I am doing this as a... Uh, someone who has a partner that is right there with them. And Jennifer is not only a, a mother, but she's also helping to take care of other people in her family. So it is very, she's doing something really difficult that I just applaud you for. I just want you to know. Thank I applaud you. So you. I watch you from afar on your Instagram. I said, look at her over here still looking cute. She ain't gained no weight. How the hell you go through as much stress as you and not gain no goddamn weight? <laughs> I'll be stressing out for you picking up the pounds. I'll be like, oh my God, is she okay? Is she all right? <laughs> I just want to. So cheers to you, Jennifer. Thank you. For being a boss ass. I so that. You're very welcome, girl. Mm -hmm. I really want to surprise our audience and I want them to hear what if they said, okay, Jennifer, we really need to hear you doing a South African accent. Can you just give us something? I'm going to give you some clues because I have had to do a South African accent, but it was a, over 10 years ago. Okay. It sounds almost like a fairy tale when compared to a, an American accent. Okay. So it's not as like deep and hard hitting as like a West African or Nigerian accent. Okay. That's the best way I can compare it. It sounds almost like a, if you think of Trevor Noah, who's from South Africa, yeah. his voice doesn't have like the deeper tones to it. It almost sounds like if he was a fairy. What would that sound like? And your <clears throat> line is, I, I came here to get married, not to go to war. That's your line. I came here to get married, not to go to war. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> today you can support Jennifer Freeman for the low, low. <laughs> Two dollars and five cents a day. Cause she is not booking this job. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen. I think that was actually it was actually better than my south, my southern accent. Yes. Right? I, because I knew you weren't from here. <laughs> I just didn't know where. I said, where is Jennifer from? Where is this character from? <laughs> okay, we're going to add our last touches. This is going to go down in the history of yeah. Jennifer Freeman's greatest hits. Yeah. Um, along with all of her roles. But yeah, Jennifer has really been working hard. And more so, she has really been keeping herself looking amazing while doing it so well. And not everybody can do that. Listen. Thank you. That is hard. Like, we can say what we want, but it is not easy at all to do it. And I thank you for making time to do the crafts and the cocktails. Thank you so okay, much. Okay, one more cheers to you, and then okay. we're going to present. Cheers to you, Jennifer. All right. Ding, 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 ding. Ding, ding, ding. Mm. You're over here crunching ice. There's a woman good. that has been through some things in life. <laughs> She's like, mm -hmm. okay. <laughs> okay, so Jennifer, you're going to present to your camera your journal and explain to them what they are seeing. <laughs> <laughs> okay. mm, see, I like it. That is shaking off all the weight of the world. Oh, yes. So... This is, this is me. Mm -hmm. And this is just how I see life. Like, you know, I keep going and. Um, so what is the nipple course, coming out the middle of your chest? Well, that is actually not a nipple. That, uh, that, it's a penis? What is this? You know what? I just liked orange and I just ah, put it in the middle. Of she's an orange glob. It's her energy. Yes, it's my energy. Um, um, but you know, it's like celebration. Like I love, you know, life. So it's like we wanted to like, you know, be like a like party. Party. You know? mm -hmm. It's a party. It's mm -hmm. a party. We're, we're going to have fun. 
excuse me. <laughs> Here's my journal. It says, live free. I was gonna put or die trying. But, <laughs> you know, this is what, being a 41 year old woman, about to be 42 years old this year, this is what I'm doing. I'm living free. I'm living free, like you said, of the expectations and the judgment of others. And I'm living free of my own self-doubt. That's what this journal is. And guess what I'm gonna do with this? Never write in it, because I don't have time. <laughs> you guys, this has been another great episode of Crafts and Cocktails yes. with my very good friend, Jennifer Freeman, who you can follow on Instagram at Miss Jen Freeman. At Miss Jen Freeman, one N. M S Jen Freeman, one N, yes. One N. M S J E N Freeman, because she's free, man. Free That's what she's trying to man. tell you. Yes. Oh, look, live free. You see how I did that? Yes, <laughs> I love it. <laughs> <laughs> Again, you can watch Crafts and Cocktails on That Chick Angel TV on YouTube, as well as Kev on Stage Studios app, which you can get for the low low of like $6 a month or something like that. The, the year subscription is even cheaper. And we got so much great content. So go on over here and pay that money and see this shit. Um, So until next time, keep crafting and keep living free and having joy in orange penises growing out of your <laughs> Bye! Bye. <laughs> so what is your, what's going to be your approach for this derby hat? Because I, 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 I see really, you already gluing. Yeah, I Let love the flowers. Sticks. Let me get you some more sticks because you ain't got I need sticks. sticks. I love flowers. I want the floral shit. You know how they come in there? Yeah. Them white ladies be walking in there with all the flowers hanging off. Let's and I just feel like... You know, you're gonna get these flowers. You're gonna smell these flowers. You're gonna smell these flowers. As soon as I walk in. Okay, and as they. Uh, and I don't. Oh. Don't worry about that. I think she needed a sip. No, you correct. Ding, 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 ding. Mmm. Mm hmm. This is really good. These raspberries, like. I love a good tart drink. Oh my gosh, these raspberries. And it makes you feel like you're drinking healthy because the fruit yeah, and the freshness. Listen, I think our drinking is healthy.